Hello from onboard Egypt Air Flight MS-777 as we descend through the clouds above London, England. The Boeing 787-9 wing flexing as we line up runway 27 left for arrival. Upon landing, we'll be headed to Terminal 2, the Star Alliance Terminal at Heathrow, where I am connecting to my Air Canada flight to Toronto. Let's see how it goes. I'm hoping that despite a short transfer window, I will have enough time to see the terminal. Welcome to the channel everyone. If you're new here, you'll find airline trip reports and other travel adventures on my channel. If you like the content, please do hit the like and subscribe buttons. Heathrow is one of the world's busiest airports. And the last time I connected through London, back in 2003, the current Terminal 2 was not operational. At that time, I transited through Terminal 3, and all I remember were the low ceilings and extremely long corridors. Let's see what Terminal 2 has in store for us. After pulling into our gate at Terminal 2B, we deplaned, went up the escalator, and to the upstairs corridor, taking passengers to the arrival and transit portion of the terminal. After walking for a bit, we then headed down this long escalator, passing the departure level before finally arriving at the underground level. Here, passengers are split into two streams, those headed to immigration and baggage claim, and another for those transiting or connecting at Heathrow. There was a massive flight information board providing info on all flights and their respective terminals. Luckily, I didn't have to change terminals as Air Canada also departs from Terminal 2. A cart pulled up to transport folks with mobility issues. I regretted not getting on because as soon as the cart left and we made the next turn in the walkway, we were staring at a never ending corridor. This looked like it was at least a kilometer. Thankfully, there were some moving sidewalks to help, but even with those, it took quite some time to get to the end. Finally, we emerged above ground in the security clearance area. Security here was relatively pain free, but they are very picky about your fluids being in a clear Ziploc bag. After security, we had to grab yet another escalator to go up where we emerged into the airy atrium of Terminal 2A. Quite a nice looking terminal. Terminal 2 opened in 2014 and has many of the features found in new terminals around the world. We had a browse around Harrods and some of the other shops.
The terminal also features nice views of runway 27 left, as you can see by the butter landing of Kuwait Airways Boeing 777. After watching a few more arrivals, we made our way back to the atrium area The departure board was showing go to gate for our flight AC 857 to Toronto. Thus began the long trek back to Satellite Pier 2B back down deep under the apron and down the long never-ending corridor before finally reaching the departures level. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please hit that like button. Thanks for watching.